I think for this new campaign, I want to play a monk. So, martial arts, key points, monastery, stuff like that? It's funny you mention that because my character is actually the last surviving member of their monastery. Really? What happened? Well, in an attempt to extend the reach of their empire, a tyrannical dictator decided to order the systematic execution of my people. Well, tell me more about your character. Well, he's happy-go-lucky, but he bears the weight of world-changing responsibility. Uh-huh. And so, alongside his friends, a wise-cracking but kind-hearted soldier and a maternal figure that he has a weird sexual tension with, they travel the world in search of masters so that they can hone their skills and eventually stand up to the kingdom responsible for taking everything from them. Okay, well, tell me about some of these masters. Well, a vast majority of them preside in spirit form and can only communicate to me when the time is right, but when they do, they impart upon me knowledge lost to time. And I'm assuming it's this great knowledge granted to you by past generations that helped you win in the end. No, not at all. In fact, they were completely useless. The only reason I managed to win in the end is because of wisdom granted to me by a giant kaiju. A giant ki- Are you playing a-